I've got this old photo and it's, I finished fixing it except for the top border which somebody cut off with a pair of scissors at some point and I'd like to put it back on and what I can do is I can copy the bottom border flip it over and put it on top but the photo is too small it would be right over her head to do it so to fix it we need to make the canvas bigger so we come up here to image and click it click canvas size make sure this chain is unlinked choose height put in a higher value then hit tab that act activates the up arrow on the y-axis push it all the way till it can't go any farther then click resize now it's added this canvas but it's checkered it, you can't use it yet gotta go back up to image come down here where it says flatten image and click it now that's part of the canvas and I'm going to zoom in right here I'm going to choose my clone tool I'm going to pick one of these vertical lines right here and I'm going to choose that and then I'm going to come up here and get my point on the same vertical line in the door jam here and drag by doing it this way all my woodwork and edges line up And we're going to zoom out. We extended the photo up a little so the border won't be sitting right on top of her head. And zoom in on the bottom of this photo. Choose my mask tool. Okay. And select the bottom of this border of this photo. Try not to get any of the dark area. Choose edit, copy, edit, paste. Choose the move tool, zoom out. drag this up choose the rotate tool put in minus 180 Click rotate. Okay. Now it's rotated. Go back to your move tool. Go right up here. And that looks pretty good. Go up to image, flatten image. Go up to zoom, zoom in on the corner here. There's a bit of a line across 
So you want to use your crop, uh, clone tool. Choose a spot. Make it a little transparent. And just click. And you get rid of the line. And you go over to the other corner. Do the same thing. Choose your crop tool. Select an area. And then click anywhere inside your selection to complete your crop. Go to File, Save. To save a copy of this picture, go up to File, click Export, give it a name, choose a location, and you have a photograph. And that's how we extended the canvas, added a border, and made it look like the whole picture was there. And that's all there is to it. I hope you liked it. If it helped, please comment, rate, or subscribe. Thanks for watching. Bye.